I want to kind of know about the market. So like you, like, you know, you are, you said you're empowering about hundred million users are using you guys, right? You're working with some amazing innovative companies right now. And we're seeing the trends in the chat space with like the voice, voice notes and the video trends. What other trends do you see that might happen in the next 10 years or what companies are like, you know, requesting from you guys? Yeah, I, I think there's gotta be just a lot of explosion of machine learning and AI. And I know people say it all the time, but I'm actually saying real practical use cases before it's like, oh, there's gonna be some AGI chatbots gonna, you know, be a fortune teller for your life. Uh, I do think that's gonna come someday. Uh, but I think right now, when you come down to specific use cases or verticals, I do think there's a lot of role for machine learning and AI to play. For instance, like moderation is something that we care about. So there are just a lot of messages that go through chat, right? And there's no company in the world who can hire a thousand reps to go through all the chat history to, and there's also borderline privacy. If it's like private conversation, if it's public conversation, you can't possibly moderate everything that's happening on Twitch, for example, right? So there's some level of moderation that needs to happen uh, automatically. Now, people are very smart at getting around moderation. If you block a certain word, people will figure out clever ways to still say the same thing without using the same spelling. So being able to adapt to those, you know, ever-changing uh, uh, adaptation uh, of the users is uh, just where machine learning will come uh, in handy. And also other things like transactions, if you are ordering food, doing ride hailing, making purchase, there's always a repeat conversation that comes in slightly different forms. There's usually a very good answer, right? So how do we create an automated template or smart re response for the sellers or buyers? Um, and, and again, through machine learning to drive up conversions and increase customer satisfaction, all that I think needs to be done through uh, uh, machine learning. Other things like sentiment analysis, really understanding all of this. Right now, I think the Gen 1 was enabling conversations to is really understanding and giving those insights back to the um, platforms or the service providers so that they can actually improve their quality of their service. And uh, I think the end users benefit from that as well. So I think that's gonna be a massive, massive trend. Um, yeah, I guess we can stop there, but I think engage, and one thing I love about, was it Elon Musk or Jeff Bezos said it, it's like, don't think about what's changing, but think about what's not going to change. Is chat something new it's like no like people have been chatting since phone you know pony express telephones or modem dial -up modems networks we've always wanted to chat with some someone in real life synchronously or asynchronously now mobile devices have completely gave that universal access to almost everyone because of that messaging app took off it's not because messaging is something that's yep. new there's a innate desire that's probably not going to change uh, now we are gonna uh, hopefully unlock some of those potential. Now we can actually travel and share experiences with other people in a, a lot more immersive way. There's gotta be some human connection elements to that, whether through voice, video, uh, physical interactions within a virtual environment, sharing 3D photos, 3D videos together. Uh, so how is, does that interaction kind of pan out? Of course, right now it's very limited due to hardware uh, limitations. But with Quest 2, I think there's some glimpse of hopes there. So I think that's going to be a more of a longer term trend, but I feel like that's the only way for us to do space travel is through VR. Otherwise we'll be bored to death. But if we are in a VR world, at least we'll be, we'll be able to have fun while we're going to Mars and stuff like that. So I do, I'm a very long VR believer, um, things like that. So.